Hi, today we're going to make some meatloaf in the Dutch oven. We're going to do this in a 12 inch Dutch oven here. So what we did is uh, we made our own seasoning for the meatloaf, but we got a pound of ground beef and a pound of ground pork and then the seasoning is, uh, well this is the breadcrumbs. We put a quarter of a cup of breadcrumbs, two tablespoons of some shredded Parmesan cheese, and then a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar and a teaspoon of salt, and then all these are half a teaspoon of garlic powder, uh, oregano, black pepper, basil, and onion powder, and then I added just a pinch of marjoram leaf, and then one egg and a half of onion, and just made a loaf. I'll just kind of tilt that there, so that's like that. We're gonna cook this at about 350 degrees, and it'll cook for about 45 minutes to an hour. We're gonna put some veggies in here with us too, so we had Got three uh, red potatoes. I'll just kind of put these around the side. Looks like four of these golden potatoes. And then we had two large carrots. So I'll just kind of do this. I have my briquettes warming up outside, so we'll get this all put together and then we'll go outside and, and start cooking this. Okay, let's get this meatloaf cooking. We're gonna do 350 like I said before. So with the 12 inch Dutch oven, I have 10 briquettes there on the bottom. So let's just uh, set that Dutch oven right there. And then I want 14 on top. That's three, seven. And I'm gonna give it two extra because it's like 20 degrees right now. So that should be good. So we have that there. Like I said, it'll cook for 45 minutes to an hour, but we'll check it uh, in 45-ish, I guess. So we'll see you back. All right, it's been 45 minutes. So let's see how this meatloaf's doing. It smells awesome. Nice and steamy. So what I want to do is test one of these potatoes. They're still a little, little bit firm. And while we got the lid off, I'll just check the check the temperature of the meat. Kind of stick that in there. If I can see that, it's a little dark. Here, let me turn it this way. There we go. So we want to want this about 165 degrees, but it's going up, but that smells good. Let's check one of these carrots, but look at that. That's nice and steamy. Yeah, they're still a little bit, a bit firm, but look at that. Uh, the juice is coming out of that meatloaf. Awesome. Yeah. Went up the canyon today and done a little snowshoe and we've had fun, sat in the hot tub today. Now we're cooking this yummy stuff in the Dutch oven. So I think we're gonna give this about 15 or 20 minutes. That says 158. So we want 165. So we'll just put this back on. And then my briquettes have burned down a little bit. They're kind of small. And I have a few small leftovers right here. See, they're just little nuggets, so. I'm just going to go ahead and throw all these little little ones on here. My knees get wet from the snow, but we'll be okay. And we'll give this 15 minutes and we'll be ready to go. Alright, it's been 15 minutes, so we should be good to go. So let's serve this up. Pull that off. Let me just... Oh yeah, that smells sweet. Let me, uh, what I want to do. Oh yeah, those are great. Let me kind of get a little piece of this wheat loaf here. That is awesome. Get some of that on there. With a cold out like this outside, it's cool. It's all steamy. 
try to do that. Let me set that knife there and let's get some of these potatoes. Let's get one of those, one of those. Carrots, set that there. Let's take a look at this. Oh yeah, look at that. Awesome stuff. So, let me set right that, that right there and I'll show you this. Uh, here you go, Dutch oven meatloaf. We've done potatoes, carrots. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time.